Johnny Flores and this is my AQHA Young Horse Development Program video update to my Ranching Heritage Breeder. Um, to start, I wanted to just say a special thanks to Jasmine and Coberstein and the whole Coberstein family at 7X Ranch for donating a weanling to me um, and just for being part of the program, you know, generous breeders like you um, and many other people uh, just like you make the program. Without you guys, it wouldn't even be possible. And another thanks to AQHA for accepting me into the program and giving me a quarter horse. You know. That's just an amazing opportunity alone. Um, so yeah, so far we've been working a lot in the past six and a half months and we had quite a few shows to attend, but they all got canceled because of COVID lockdowns and whatnot. So we did two virtual shows. One was a normal showmanship and we didn't place, but she was going against seasoned horses and we still did good, I think, in my opinion. And then we did an Australian extreme cowboy race. Um, it was again virtual. And we didn't, we didn't place in either of them, but they're her first two shows ever. Um, and yeah, so I just wanted to show you guys what I've been doing for the past six and a half months. So without further ado, here is my video. Just enjoy how cute she is. Be honest. Anyways, um, <laughs> before I show you more about her current progress and where she is at now, I just want to talk a little bit about um, first getting her and things we've been working on. Um, to begin, when I first got her, she was very flighty, very, very spooky, and she was unhandled. You know, she's a baby. Her only ever person was her mommy. So seeing humans, she's like, what the heck? Um, so it was nice to be able to have experience with wild mustangs because that whole join up and spookiness uh, being able to work with that really helped with her, um, but slowly and slowly but surely she started to warm up to me and now she's a cuddle bug. She takes every second she can to like wrap her head around your torso or just sit with you, be with you. Um, so that was a really big milestone for us and it took about a month of solid just like, let me love you, <laughs> you know. Um, and in training, one of our biggest challenges was that, was getting her to like me, was getting her to have an interest, you know? Like, um, not just allowing me to be with her, but wanting me to be with her. And I think we're finally there, you know? It took a little while. Um, another challenge, this is pretty funny. She is cow bred, she's NRCHA bred, so she spins very fast. <laughs> and in working on them, I can't keep up, I have to run another challenge and our, our future plans after exiting the program and just keeping her training and stuff I want to eventually enter her in NRCHA and anything she's good at really hopefully cow sports but without further ado I just wanted to show you guys my current progress so here it is one more thing one more thing I almost forgot my thank yous um, I just wanted to first thank my family for supporting me and helping me throughout this project especially my brother I get the unique opportunity to work for him for Roberto Flores Horsemanship and learn a lot and uh, have him keep an eye on me while I work with this amazing horse. Uh, thanks again to 7X Ranch, the Coberstein family, and AQHA for accepting me into the program. And my sponsor, Bardsley Products, they make her look beautiful for her monthly reports. Uh, highly recommend them.